sprinkle cookies. Yes. So we made them a couple days, weeks ago? A couple weeks ago, yeah. yeah. When we saw Disney was releasing all of its lovely recipes since they've been closed and we love Disney. And so this is one of the recipes that we had all the ingredients for. And so we are going to show you how we made them in case you would like to make them at home now that everybody's stuck inside for quarantine. So go ahead, Angie's. Okay. So show us what you're up to. Now we are doing this all by hand, but in the recipe it recommends if you have a mixer, like a hand mixer. Right. Yeah. But we are using our hand to mix it. Right? it becomes kind of thick like brownie like so it'll become nice thick chocolate almost ball like and then you wrap it and put it in the fridge for three hours, three hours or yeah or up to 24 hours until it's cold the dough all of it now it's really thick and then it will be like a dough ball once it's cold. And now you're gonna cover it. And it's all mixed. It's a really simple recipe. And then it goes in the refrigerator. Three hours. For three hours to cool until it's like a, a ball of dough, but not sticky. Right now it's yeah. sticky, so. All right, we'll come back and finish baking them later. And we put some parchment paper, wax paper down on our cookie sheet and heat of the oven 350, right? What are yep. we missing? Powdered sugar. Powdered sugar. So last time we made them kind of big and they came out nice, but we didn't flatten them. And I think you need to, even though the directions did not say that. The directions said yeah, but they didn't really spread out, so we kind of ended up pushing them down partway through cooking, right? So we're just going to push them down. Yeah, I would push them down. Yeah. I would roll them in and like kind of push them down a little bit, Yeah. but smaller. Last time we made, what, 12? Yeah. I so. so we'll try to make a few more so they're not quite so big. Now, we were a little disappointed. They were Mickey Magical Cookie Crinkle Cookies. They were not shaped like Mickey Mouse's. That I was a little bit sad about, but Which, that's upsetting. yeah, but I we were gonna try to make them in the shape of Mickey Mouse's, but I don't know if you really could, but they are delicious. So you make a little ball, roll it in powdered sugar, and or a medium scooper was what the directions said, right? A medium scoop. Well, we don't. Enough. Yeah, we don't have a medium scoop, yeah. so we're rolling them in similar size balls. Dipping them in powdered sugar and then putting them on the tray. All right, so Anji rolled out all these beautiful little balls and we felt like they needed a little bit more powdered sugar. So we're sprinkling them on. That means the oven is at 350. So last time we made, what, what did we say, 12? We this, made 12. This time, how many did we make? We made them smaller. We made uh, 21. 20. Go in the oven. 
seven. What is it? Eight minutes? Ten minutes. Eight to ten minutes. Um, All right, well, we'll check back. Mm. They look so good. Mm. They look so good, though. They look so good. I don't want to eat. Yeah, they're done. They're done? Yep. Woo so, recommendations definitely push them down a little bit extra powdered sugar if you like <laughs> right and then this was eight minutes on 350 and they seem perfect yeah so we'll just have to test them out right what do you think yeah so that this is our version of mickey ears and um all right go ahead and try one see how they are delicious all right